for the Richard Timbers here. So Zambia my reviews for the Star movies because of uh Yeah, because of Spar, here's my review for Saw Sex, which premiered all the way back in two thousand nine. Now, Saw Sex, you know, this time around was directed by Kevin uh, Gertart and was scripted by both uh, Patrick Melton and Marcus Dustin. And this time around, uh, the, you know, uh, similar to his predecessor, uh, you know, Saw Sex pretty much pertains the uh, focus on the uh, post-humorous uh, effects of the Jigsaw Killer and on um, the aggression um, of his uh, successor, Mark Hoffman. And so, the, like the plot, of course, uh, follows this insurance um, executive who must complete a series of a of like a deadly games to uh, s that was set off by Hartman um, in order to like rescue his employees and all. And so, like the um, FBI, of course, comes to suspect that uh, Pierce Shram, uh, Shraham, who uh, was of course framed by Hartman um, as being a Jigsaw's assessor, is not actually like a Jigsaw's uh, accomplice and um, reopens the investigation. Drawing, uh, you know, Hartman uh, into like motion to protect his uh, secret identity and all that. Uh, I mean, once again, you had Tobin Bell reprise his role as Jigsaw, aka, uh, you know, John Kramer. You also had uh, Kosas Mandela once again reprising his role as Mark Hartman. You also had uh, Betsy Russell. You know, you even had uh, Roderick himself, Devin Bostic, who actually um, appeared in this. Uh, you had some really, you know, uh, cool, you know, uh, supporting cast members. You also had Shawnee uh, Smith um, reprise their role. <coughs> Stop that. And the kills in this thing was as cool, too. Uh, the traps was pretty cool. You know, uh, you got someone who's, uh, whose ribs ends up getting uh, crushed by um, a vice. You got loads, like, people getting uh, stabbed in the gut. Uh, you got loads of, you get got loads of insane uh, kills in this. It's as, like, the Saw movies, like I said, get a scory um, as soon as uh, the films go on. Uh, Mark Hartman is a really cool um, villain here. I thought uh, Kosas, you know, definitely plays his role pretty well here. Uh, the violence is great. You know, it, it's, like, the acting obviously isn't the best, but, like I said, you don't expect great top-notch acting for these type of movies. But I definitely thought, uh, you know, the act, like, uh, the acting definitely wasn't the best um, part, but, you know, um, yeah, the, of course, the uh, credits, you know, at the end was, uh, you know, like, the end, um, you know, was insane. Uh, definitely a really cool uh, sum of the Star movies. You know, uh, if you guys haven't seen it, of course, Star 6 is on HBO Max, so give that one a go. Anyway, let me leave you guys. Have you ever seen Star 6? And so, what Star movie? Were you a fan of it? Were you not a fan of it? Where does it rank on your uh, favorite Star films? Drop comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that bell for more notifications. This is Simu Sayon.